Holy freaking cow, I love A Nightmare on Elm Street, and not just the original either. I love the sequels, the remake, the TV show. I can't get enough of Freddy Krueger. He is the man of my dreams. What happens when you've exhausted all media about him? You've seen all of his movies hundreds of times. You've even watched the special features so many times that you can quote them. Well, the only place to go from here is down. Down to ripoff land, where the action figures look like this and the smell of cheap plastic is in the air. A place where everything that is popular is turned into a million bootleg versions of itself. And Freddy Krueger was popular. There was a time where Freddy Krueger was king of the world. TV show, music, merchandising, costumes, toys, and even video games. If you were a Krueger fan, living in the 80s was a dream come true. The success of Freddy Krueger was felt across the world, and that's why I'm combing the planet to find the best Freddy Krueger ripoffs. Some of these movies rip off the plot, some rip off the dream elements, and some even rip off the lovable characteristics of Kruger himself. Heck, there are some films that rip off all three. You won't believe what some of these movies are trying to get away with. You can call these movies rip-offs, clones, maybe you can even say that they're inspired by A Nightmare on Elm Street, but one thing is for certain, they were trying to cash in on the success of the dream demon himself. This is The Fall of Freddy Krueger, rip-offs of A Nightmare on Elm Street. So join me, The Hellbound Horror Show, every Monday and Saturday in October as we take a look at some popular and some obscure Freddy Krueger knockoffs. It's going to be a lot of fun and I hope to see you there. But in the meantime, whatever you do, don't fall asleep. <laughs>